The world starts celebrating International African Children's Day since 1991. The day is now being celebrated for the 29 times in Tigray and for 32 times in Ethiopia. As Africans, two grandchildren who have severely traumatized by the war also celebrate the day with their parents lost sheltered in tents begging for food. Celebrating the anniversary, head for Bureau of Social Affairs and Rehabilitation, Major General Zodukiro states that Tigray children are celebrating the day while suffering from multiple Still, the children in Tigray are under poor situation while they celebrate International African Children on 16th of June. Since the last two months, Tigray children have begun education, hoping tomorrow will be better. The crowded schools full of hopeful children were damaged due to the daily war that was ignited in November of 2020 and lasts until November 2022 with a peace agreement signed between by the federal government and the TPLF. Uh, Schools are damaged. Children are also in problem. It's not only lack of equipments like pen or books, but also starvation as it renders them weak to learn. Major General Zodokiros also stated that those who are in school must learn. Those who are in IDP's camps should return back home. She says it is the responsibility of all. Due to the war, many psychological and physical damages occurred to the children. Separated children need to meet their parents. Parents also want to make sure their children are safe. Everyone should help the children. African Children's Day started after the 10,000s of children protest from quality of education and the right to be taught by their native language in Soweto, South Africa, 1991.